Hey guys, how's it going? Welcome back to another video. In this video, it's all gonna be about Red Dead Online DLC. So DLC of course made GTA Online one of the biggest online experiences in history, and Red Dead Online is about to be even bigger. So we're gonna be talking about future DLC release dates, how everything is going to be working out, and also some possible DLCs we should be receiving very soon. So we got a ton of stuff to cover in this video, so I recommend you guys stick around for the entire thing. But anyways, if you haven't already, be sure to drop a like, and also subscribe down below for more daily Red Dead 2 content just like this. But with that being said, and without further ado, let's go ahead and do the two shoutouts of the day, and right at we'll get into the actual video. So the first quick shoutout of the day goes to Am Z Man. he does some really awesome gaming videos over on his channel, he posts videos every single Saturday with his friends, playing new games and old games and everything in between. So go ahead and check out his channel in the description down below, and subscribe over there. And the final quick shoutout of the day goes to Keto Kofi, it's a really awesome tumbler drink cup, you guys can pretty much put any kind Kind of liquid in there and it will stay cold or hot for over 24 hours. It is available on Amazon.com exclusively right now for a super low price, so go ahead and check that out in that description down below. But with that being said, and without further ado, let's go and get right into this video. So as I mentioned in the intro, pretty much the only reason why people still play GTA Online is because of DLC. DLC is a big part of GTA Online, and a lot of people, including myself, became accustomed to kind of getting new content almost every single month and enjoying that new content. And that is why people love GTA Online, because Rockstar was updating it constantly with new things to do, fun things to play, and pretty much a lot of things to enjoy with your friends. Now with that success of GTA Online, Rockstar is going to be going ahead and making an even larger focus on DLC for Red Dead Online. So this is obviously going to include monthly DLC with new content where you can play and enjoy, it's pretty much going to be like GTA Online DLC every single month with new content for Red Dead Online including new game modes, new types of jobs, and pretty much new content which you can go ahead and enjoy. Now since Red Dead Online didn't come out yet, we don't really have an idea of what kind of DLC we will be getting yet, however in this video I want to discuss a handful of DLCs I did discuss in a previous video, but these are DLCs that the community is really looking forward to, and most likely Rockstar is going to be releasing these DLCs into Red Dead Online Online at one point or another. And don't forget, all these DLCs will be free, so you will be able to play them at no additional cost, and also if you do want to go ahead and buy shark cards or whatever they're going to be calling them inside Red Dead Online to purchase the items quicker, you can go ahead and do that. But all these DLCs for online will be free and everyone with Red Dead Online will be able to go ahead and play them. So the first thing everyone wants that played the original Red Dead is going to be a version 2 of the Undead Nightmare DLC. Now if you guys did not play the original Red Dead or you don't really know what I'm talking about. Basically what Rockstar did is released a zombies type DLC for the original Red Dead and it was pretty much a zombie DLC and it was called Undead Nightmare. Now a lot of people enjoyed that and the community feedback on that DLC was absolutely phenomenal and I do think Rockstar is going to be going ahead and making a part 2 of that, however this time it will be for Red Dead Online. Now in terms of the nitty gritty details, in terms of how they're going to be implementing this and all that other stuff, obviously we don't really know that at the moment, but if I had to guess one of the first DLCs for Red Dead Online, I would imagine Rockstar releasing an Undead Nightmare Part 2. That's going to be a super cool idea and I'm sure a lot of the OG fans of Red Dead will really enjoy that. Now, don't forget there will be monthly DLC for Red Dead Online, so if you don't like a DLC one month, most likely next month there will be a new content DLC that you will definitely enjoy. At one point this was of course the case for GTA Online with monthly content and that was a great time for online for GTA 5, however recently Rockstar did take a small hiatus in terms of DLC and we have not got a DLC for the last couple months, but pretty much all that means is that they're working as much as they can on Red Dead 2 and most importantly Red Dead Online with new DLC for that. So again, every single month we will be receiving new content, and I think that's going to make a lot of people excited to play Red Dead Online, because the awesome thing is that it's constantly evolving, and there's always going to be something new for you to go ahead, try out, play, and even enjoy. So the question a lot of people are asking right now is when we're going to be getting the first DLC after the original Red Dead Online release? Now, this is going to be a hard question to answer because first off, Red Dead Online is initially going to be coming out in a beta phase, which I highly doubt is going to be any DLC supported within that beta time period. 
So the question is, how long is the beta going to last? I would imagine the beta will last about a month, and then we will be getting the final release of Red Dead Online, and then hopefully from there we should be getting a month later an actual DLC for Red Dead Online, which will mark the first official DLC update for Red Dead Online. So pretty much, the only way we can speculate right now is a month after the actual release date of Red Dead Online, after it comes out of beta, we should be getting the first DLC. But again, we really don't know at this point how long the beta is going to last. I personally think it's going to be lasting about a month. Let me know in the comments down below how you guys feel about the beta. I honestly don't really know. I never really seen Rockstar do a beta. I don't even think they've ever have done a public beta for any kind of online game. It really seems like something EA would do, which actually EA does, and we all know how the gaming industry doesn't really like how EA does these betas. This is kind of weird for Rockstar to go ahead and follow the norm, but if they do it correctly and they let people actually play the game and experience it without any kind of restrictions during the beta period, I think it's going to be a success, and honestly, I think it's a great time for them to go ahead and fix all the bugs and fix all the major glitches before they make the final release. So at this point of me making this video, we're about a week or two until the actual gameplay trailer for Red Dead Online, and in that time period we will be getting a ton of information, mainly including how the beta is going to work, also the actual release date for the beta, and also some gameplay of Red Dead Online and how everything is going to be working. So that is pretty much what everyone is looking forward to right now, counting myself, and of course make sure you guys are subscribed down below. So when that video does come out on Rockstar's official social media, I'm going to be doing a live analysis, probably during a live stream or something, and also a handful of videos talking about all the details and everything we can expect from Red Dead Online. But anyways, that's pretty much going to wrap up this video. I just wanted to make a video because I know a lot of you guys have been asking about DLC. Again, I wanted to kind of go over everything we know at the moment, and that is pretty much everything we know. So let me know your thoughts and comments in those comments down below. What kind of DLC are you looking forward to? What kind of DLC do you want? Let me know all your thoughts in those comments down below. Also, if you haven't already, be sure to drop a like and also subscribe down below for more daily Red Dead Redemption 2 content just like this. And also, if you do subscribe, I want to remind you guys to please be sure to hit that bell icon so you guys are notified every single time I make an upload. I know the subscription boxes on YouTube have been a mess recently, and if you guys hit that bell, you should most likely get a notification on both your phone and your PC when I upload a brand new video. But again, thank you for watching today's video, and I'll be sure to see you guys tomorrow morning with yet another Red Dead Redemption 2 video just like this. But anyways, thank you for watching, and I'll be sure to talk to you guys then.